Hello, welcome guys to another tutorial of Vector Academy. Today I'm going to show you how to slow down or speed up your uh, video file. We're going to use Vegas Pro. Here a small clip, you can get it on my channel if you want. Uh, so what we basically want to do is the part we are moving fast we want um, we want to, to, to speed up so it doesn't take a while before we are at their base and start killing them so we go back and we want until here we want to be speed speed up so we press S to cut so remember if you want a particular part uh, to speed up or slow down, you have to make it apart to stand apart from the others. So we've cut it, and you see here it's a uh, single layer. It, it, it's a uh, layer that's sta it's apart from the others. Uh, so in Sony Vegas, it, it's really simple to speed up something or even to slow down. So we press Control, and you'll see a small. Uh, underline under the cross uh, under the uh, mouse so we drag it if we drag it at the left we want to speed it up and you will hit a certain limitation and that's the fastest fastest it can be so if we play it now we can see how fast it is so we want a little bit slower so we're gonna press again control then drag it out a little bit so it looks better then the video is going to start yeah and if we forward a little bit you see here we kill wait uh, no, no, no. yeah you see here we kill two guys so we want to slow this part down and if you want to move with frames you can just click your arrows and you'll move one frame forward or backward so uh, and here we see them so here we want to start so we press S again to cut it and then where we going to end we cut it again so you see this has an up and different lay uh, and uh, it, this stands out from the other so press control again drag it out and you'll see will be much slower see and bam 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 and that's the end oh, we want a little bit faster oh no oh, the wrong a little bit faster so it looks better now remember if you slow down something and um, it has low frames it's gonna look weird so if you wanna if you really want a good nice slow motion effect you will need to capture something at more than 60, 60 frames per second uh, if you get that and slow it down you'll get a nice cool effect so actually that was the whole tutorial thank you for following uh, this tutorial I hope you did like this tutorial, uh, be sure to click the like button, subscribe and if you have any questions, leave them down below. See you guys, until next time.